So basically, Tando Kwetu, we are rehabilitating the school. So for us to start with the rehabilitation of the school, we obviously have to install the borehole. So our geo um, hydrologist, uh, Jacques, you can there, um, he's the one that came to do a survey. Um, after the survey, uh, we actually found two points. One of the points is actually at the back of the school there, uh, of which we'll go there um, in, a, in a minute. And the other is the point over here. Um, we actually wanted to drill there, the first uh, hole, 
But unfortunately, the truck was actually too big, and there's a municipal electrical cable that uh, the truck could not uh, maneuver itself around. So we had to settle for that uh, second option there. Um, the hydrogeologist uh, investigated and saw that uh, it would take about 150 uh, meters to reach the water table. So right now they're at uh, 66, yes? Um, and uh, David, um, David from Hilson and Drilling, um, he is uh, the, the, the lead man for Hilson and Drilling. I'm sure you can just have a small introduction from yourself. Yeah, nice to, nice to see you all here. Um, yeah, I'm the owner of Hilson Drilling and was approached by Munya of Islamic Relief. And um, I made a few suggestions, which one of which was in, to in, get a, ge a professional geohydrologist in between us and you, so that there's a, a competent person uh, in charge of, of, of the project for you, on your behalf. So that's where we are. He's marked this place. I, I don't think it's second choice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're both on the same line. That's true. That's true. Um, and as we've just been chatting, Jacques and I, the, 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 the actual choice of hole where we are at the school is quite tricky. Uh, we ride on a, a very steep ridge, as you can all see, with big valleys on either side. So we're going to have to go pretty deep, I think, to um, have any chance of letting water. So it's very hard. It's, ta it's taking an, an hour for six meters. That's why we only had 66 meters of the drilling half a day yesterday and all day today. Anyway, yeah, well, good luck with the project and thank you for involving us. No, thank you. Yeah, just what Dave um, said, thank you. We, um, we did identify two positions. You know, ideally we would like to be sort of in the valleys a bit more, uh, shallower um, drilling and better opportunity for finding water. But I think... Um, you know, let's see what happens with these uh, positions first. Um, it's it's very sort of, sort of homogene geology. It's all granites, which is massive, massive type of rock. So you need a bit of fracturing to get water. So if you don't get fracturing, it's, you know, your chances are limited. So that's what we try to identify, fractures and lineaments, and see if we can get a, a bit of uh, water in those fractures. Uh, good morning, colleagues. I, let me, on behalf of my district director, once again express our gratitude to Islamic Relief Agency for selecting one of our schools in the poorest of our poor communities to make an investment that will uplift not just the lives of the children, but the lives of the parents, the community as a whole. As a government department, uh, one may look at the infrastructure and say, why is government not doing this? But giving, given the pressing challenges that we have and the very limited budgets that we have, we welcome the partnerships by uh, other organizations that want to join with us in order to bring relief to the people that we serve. We cannot do it alone. So we want to recognize and appreciate all the role players from Islamic Relief that have been dealing with this project, that have been on this project over the number of years. Uh, and it's such an exciting time to see it to come to fruition. I was just wondering how nice it would be to, for us to get that spray of water while we are here today. But I want to acknowledge the founder of Islamic Relief. I want to commend you, sir, for your vision. Uh, it is visionaries like you that we need to be able to make a difference in the world. So thank you so much and thank you to Islamic Relief again for choosing our school to invest in. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, maybe we can have uh, schools like that. I'd like to greet you in the name of Jesus Christ. Um, I'm Miss Zulu. Umem knows very well that I don't like to talk when um, I, I, I'm happy, in fact, and uh, I, I, I become very emotional. I think you remember the day when we were at uh, Holland. I didn't have a word to speak. 
but uh, I became so emotional. Uh, but I like to thank you very much for what you have done for the soul. <laughs> yeah. But I, I think everything, I know that everything comes from God, but God works with people who are on earth. Yeah. If one, uh, if, if God has asked someone to do the work on earth and that one who is called by God to do that work, she, he or she is being blessed and you are the man of God, you are working uh, for the God, you are doing what the God has asked you to do. So you are very, very blessed and you 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 blessed even the poor people who are even not your re you are not you are not related to them and you are even not familiar to them the community that you don't know I, I don't know what to say say um I I think I I need more words to say to you and to thank you I, but I, I don't have that much. I'm, I'm very happy. I, I, I like, I love it. You, you will understand this is all. No. <laughs> uh, I, I, we love you. We like you. We adore you. Whatever way that you can think of. I, I, may God bless you with more showers, more showers than you think you have. Thank you very much even to the one you are working with thank you very much uh, for the for these souls for this community you see the community we are working under with the condition the, the the rooms we are using to to build up the nation but you you you, you go beyond thank you very much thank you say then we are the I'm Mrs. Makatin, I'm a Shepherdson government board. I'm talking about behalf of a community. In my heart is emotional, but I don't know what I'm saying because I'm very happy. If I see it look like, like that, yesterday I'm see I'm, I I see the the motors come there, and I'm happy, but and feel emotional. So I like to say very thank you. All things that did in the school, Quebec. Thank you. God bless you. I think now that we have uh, introduced everyone and everyone has had something to say, I think Munya, you will direct us as to how the program runs. Oh, okay. Um, apologies. The architecture has said he'll make it uh, at around eleven o'clock, but it seems like he's still still running late. Um, I think what we can do for now is just take the uh, Dr. Heine just around the school just to show him. Um, Don't be emotional. We are here to serve both of you and all of you, us and David and our specialists and the government are here as your servants. The one who serves the community, the one that God has chosen him by himself, by himself. King David here is my father, and I'm King Solomon. Very pleased to meet you, King Solomon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you, my dad. <laughs> my dad, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're old man. <laughs> <laughs> but you're older, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I speak to the birds. To whom you speak to? Yeah. <laughs> Same. Same? Same, yeah. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. This is my father with me. And my daughter, my sister, my auntie, my nephew, not, not my nephew, my, <laughs> my niece, my... Thank you. I love Africa because I'm an African. I'm an African from North Africa, from Egypt. 
So our first work 40 years ago was for the famine in Eritrea and Ethiopia. At that time, Eritrea was a part of Ethiopia in 1983. That's why we started Islamic Relief as a response to the famine in Eritrea and Tigray in 1983. We learned a lot. You taught us a great deal how to become a human being when you let us to stand next to you, actually, and learn from you. See that you are suffering, but you smile at our faces. You are suffering, but you are generous with your hospitality. You are suffering, and you never said, we don't like you, we welcome you. Welcome everybody. Africa is and was and will be our teacher forever. Africa as a whole, inshallah, that's why we stand for Africa and we stand for humanity together. Don't be emotional. The money is your money, sister. The money is your money. The organization is your organization. And I am your servant. The least to say that. And as Allah said, the Prophet said in the Quran, in the Allah has chosen certain people and made them to be the servants of humanity. Made him to be love the act of goodness. Made them to love the act of goodness. It's a choice. It's all of us been chosen by Allah to serve people. It's not something haphazardly happened. David is doing the job, and you are doing the job to serve people. You have been chosen by Allah to serve people as well. He is my uncle. <laughs> many relatives. Uh, is it? So many relatives. <laughs> Deep roots. Uh, I was born 1,000 years ago. <laughs> and those people that have been chosen by Allah, by God, would be saved and saved at the day of judgment. You are one of them. Say Amen. Amen. You are one of them. Amen. You are one of them. You are one of them. Amen. Amen. Smile. Amen. <laughs> Amen. 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 All of us, alhamdulillah. So the thanking is goes for us, from us to you, not from you to us. It's coming here. To be with you is a blessing. So we both have been blessed. But they are showering your blessing to us. And the one who is seeing you and me and all of us is the creator. Subhanahu wa ta'ala. Seeing the two kings in one room. The young king <laughs> and the old king. <laughs> the kings who speak to the animals. How many languages you speak? Four. Four. No, if you have seen... Uh, Dr. Do Little movie. <laughs> <laughs> he spoke 200 yeah, languages. Yeah, all the animal languages. <laughs> animal, birds, yeah. ants. You know, once upon a time, King Solomon chose me. Yes. Yeah. You, were, you, were, you were sitting at home doing the cooking with my mother. <laughs> <laughs> and he was going with his army and he heard the ant. The ant was so scared of the, the army of Solomon, King Solomon. And the ant was telling every ant, Get inside. Suleiman and his army will destroy you. He was smiling. And he, as an act of humanity, led the army to move around, not to come to the ants' valley. You know that the, the, the ants live in a valley? The ants live in a valley. It's written in the Quran. What did Nam? Okay. So, my, your son, King David, was speaking to the ant, <laughs> which other insect you are speaking to. <laughs> you have me now. Eh? <laughs> a cricket. <laughs> God bless you, child. Yeah. May Allah bless you, child. Jazakumullah khair. We are your servant. Huh? Smile. African smile. Don't be emotional and cry. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you so much. Our program is yours. You want us to move? Okay, child. We'll move, child. Yeah, you are changing the room into library? Yes. This is going to be a library? Yes.
Yes, so this is uh, one of the rooms that's going to be a library. Uh, we obviously need to replace the trusses um, on the roof, also the asbestos. Now it's not it's not safe for you know for the asbestos children. With the lung. Is it? Asbestos. Used to study this in yeah, school. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and, and then uh, we are also going to be uh, touching up on the floors yeah, and so forth, the windows. Yes. Sorry? So there are one, two, three. So here it's a block of five. Yeah. So you, can, you can ask the camera how many, how many so, classrooms are refurbishing? So here we're going to refurbish uh, four classrooms on this row. Then the fifth one is a library. And then we have two other classrooms over here. How many children are here? So here there are 90 children 90. in total. How many boys and how many girls? So here they are 46 uh, girls. Uh, and then the rest are boys. So and, uh, this is your dream. This is the dream of the drilling machine for yes, the water. That is correct. So before we start the rehabilitation of the school, we obviously need water so that we can start the whole process of and the this water will only be used to the school or to the community as well? So basically, there are going to be two taps. There's going to be one tap inside the school and there's going to be one tap outside the school, which uh, will be used by the community. That's why we've also brought in the SBG, which is the school governing body. They will be the ones that will be using the tap that is outside. Is David who knows the capacity of water or, or the other man? So it will be uh, Jacques will be the other man. Jacob. David. Jacques? Yeah. Oh, Jacob. Jacob. Jacob of the wooden ceremony. Oh, you are Jacob. You are the grandfather, huh? Jacob, David. What's yeah, it's older. No, Jacques is Jacob, man. I know, I know. How much is the capacity of the water coming out from me? You say, thank you. So um, at this stage, there's, there's a very little, there's only a bit of seepage at the moment, but yeah. we haven't reached our, you know, full depth potential we want to go to. Yeah. Um, we're hoping to get something from about 100 to 120 meters on, but um, at this stage, you know, it's very hard. It's 66 meters. There's a little bit of seepage water that's coming in, yeah. which is promising, but it's still not sufficient to sustain, you know, the project. So we have to just keep going and, and hopefully get more fracturing. Get so, your grandfather to make it clear. <laughs> Brian, Brian, Jacob, Jacob, David, and Sullivan. <laughs> uh, all related. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we, David was saying earlier, ideally we would have wanted to go a little bit lower in that valley. You see, there's a valley just here. But that's unfortunately not part of the school property. Yeah, I see. Thank yeah. You. Well, the same here. Yeah, it's actually down this side. It goes steep. Very steeply down on this side, yeah. Yeah. Mm, that was also another area that mm. you, you spotted there. Oh, yeah. As soon as I got here this morning, I looked where the road comes. Yeah. And when Jacques, when Jacques got here, I said, hey, that's <laughs> the play. We should have been there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, we just make yeah. our... We limited to the school grounds. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, the, the, the difficult thing is, I was telling you earlier, that you have to look at... You know, you have to marry all those things where where the position is, where the geology is, where the groundwater is, you know, where your truck can get in. Mm -hmm. um, so there's a few things you have to look at, Charlie. not just uh, one thing. So it's a bit of a process. Thank you. That is Thank true. You. That yeah. is true. Yes, yes, we can also look at the other classrooms over there. Uh, class, not classrooms. Not classrooms, yeah. I guess the principals. Uh... Sing a song with you. I will sing a song. And you say, Ia, Ia, O. Ia, Ia, O. His Royal Highness has a farm. Ia, Ia, O. Ia, Ia, O. Ia, Ia, O. In his farm, he has a cuckoo. Ia, Ia, O. Ia, Ia, O. Retail cuckoo has laid an egg. Ia, Ia, O. One leg for you, one leg for me. Ia, Ia, O. One egg for you, one egg for me. Ia, Ia, O. Egg number two is for mommy. Ia, Ia, O. Mommy made Bobby legless. Ia, Ia, O. They give my sister her necklace. Ia, Ia, O. Eggless, legless, or necklace. Ia, Ia, O. 
Retil Kuku become restless. Ia, Ia, O. Retil Kuku has also said, Ia, Ia, O. How on earth I lay an egg? Ia, Ia, O. Ia, Ia, O. Can you do the animal voice? Thank you. We are all animals. <laughs> okay, give them the sweet. Yeah. One by one, you give. Assalamu alaikum. All right, which line? Are you standing in line, sister? You can. Oh, okay, you start. All right. Yes. Okay, Bismillah. Bismillah. <laughs> Why 
Kira Kira Okay, brothers and sisters. Thank you. Why? 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 Sundown. Hundred. Alas, let's go. Going? Okay, David, Jacob, Isaac. There's no Jesus here. Alas. 
Thank you. You brought the sun with you. Amen. Amen. 